Okay, sixth grade, lesson 108, and this is on transformations, okay? And if you grew up learning transformers, okay, it's basically things turn into a different um, figure. Okay, so let's, let me draw something up here first, just to talk about it for just a minute. But if you were to see a triangle that looked like this, and it had a right angle right here, and it was labeled A, B, C, like that. And then you were to see one that was just like this with an angle, C, A, B, okay? Now, can you tell that these, this triangle is congruent? And congruent means exactly the same. Can okay. you tell that they are exactly the same shape? It's just turned differently. Yes. So, for example... Okay, I'm gonna turn this, um, it's actually gonna be here. So, do you see this? Mm -hmm. A, B, C. You see that? Yep. Now, I'm gonna turn it around on the back and write A, B, and C just so you'll see it. A, C, and B. Okay, now, here we go. We have this figure right here. A, B, and C, okay? And I want you to see what happened. It turned or rotated one spot to the right and then flipped. Mm -hmm. See that? That's all it did. It went from here to one rotate and a flip. Okay, now this is a different one than this one, but I'm just trying to show you using the same um, triangle that it did something different. So these are congruent, and congruent means the exact same shape as this one. This one is just turned, okay, and flipped, okay? So, it, when you see, sometimes we'll say, like on a test, are these two triangles congruent? You would have been like, well, no, they don't even look anything the same. But, if you were to take the same triangle, rotate it, turn it, and then flip it, it is the exact same triangle. It's just turned. So. Um, yes, they are congruent. Okay, so don't let that trick you when they do that on a test. Okay? Now, if they weren't even the same size, if I had a little one down here and a big one up here, those are not congruent. <laughs> even though this one's flipped and done something different too. This one's big and this one's small. They would just be called similar. Okay? Now, let's talk about this. You're going to be learning three math words. Okay? And I'm going to write them up here. Um, rotate, which doesn't seem too mathematical, okay, rotate, which means to turn, right? All right, then we've got translate, which the only time you've heard translate up to this point is let's tra translate Spanish into English, okay? Mathematical translate is completely, completely different. It just means slide. <laughs> Don't ask me where they got the word. I have no idea. Okay, you might need to write these down so okay. you'll know what they mean. And then the last one is reflect. And it's not so much of a hard mathematical word either because it actually makes sense. And it actually means to flip something. Or it's a mirror. Okay, so let's look at rotate first. Rotation, translation, and reflection, if you were to put shine on the back of them. Rotation, translation, reflection. Those are mathematical terms. Now, if I were to take my ABC and rotate it, what you do to rotate is you take your finger and you put it in the right triangle area. And you literally move it one turn. So if I told you to rotate 90 degrees clockwise, 90 degrees clockwise, clockwise is going in the way a clock goes, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 90 degrees, remember one turn is 90 degrees, so I'm going to go one turn, boom. So if I tell you to, to rotate this triangle 90 degrees clockwise, you would go boom, okay? If I told you to go 90 degrees counterclockwise, you would go boom. Okay, so they're going to have you draw them, and it's always good to take a little sheet of paper and make one of these so that you're making sure you're doing it just right. 
okay? But you always turn it on this spot. I could turn it up here and it would be completely different. You don't want to turn it from up here. You always want to turn it from the 90 degree angle spot. Okay. Got it? All right, so that's rotate. Now let's talk about translate. It's very simple. If they tell you to translate this, this triangle, you're literally sliding it. You're not turning it, you're not flipping it, you're just sliding it. Rotate this slide, or this triangle to the right. I'm sorry, translate this triangle to the right. You would just slide it to the right, slide it to the left, okay? Now let's talk about reflect. It's not that much harder, it's actually what it means. If I had a mirror right here, it would show this. Yeah. Okay? okay. So, basically it just flips. Okay? Yep. So this is reflect. Okay? This is translate. And this is rotate. That is lesson 108.